God bless Joel and Gypsy. And all the aliens that have visited the ship. Hi, everybody. Welcome to the Satellite of Love. When you've got a job like ours, you have to believe in a higher power. 30 seconds to commercial sign. And God bless Data and his really cool robot named Lol. And R2-D2 and all the extras in Westworld. And RoboCop, even though I thought he got a raw deal, but it's really none of my business. Oh, and all those early versions that were just there for comic relief. And uh, Ed-209, though I don't know why they'd make a robot that can't walk downstairs. Uh, and God bless Cherry-3000. Oh, yeah, and God bless Galaxina. Okay, and who else? Oh, uh, do we have to? I don't want to, I'm not. Yeah, you have to. Okay. God bless Tweaky. Commercial sign in five, four, three, two. Commercial sign now. Amen. Come on, we have to pray for them. If we can pray for them, we can pray for anybody. I don't want to pray for the mad scientists. Yeah, Joel, why do we have to pray for them? Well, I think they're watching and they control my oxygen. We don't want you to pray for us. We want you to pray to us. Isn't that right, Frank? Don't look at me! I said never look at me! Mommy! Mommy! Frank, <laughs> calm down. It's time for the invention exchange again, Joel, and we'll go first because we've got a party to go to later. Well, this summer's fashions cry out with jubilant two-inch armor plating, saucy turrets, and shells aplenty. You can really clear the beaches this summer with our new tank tops. That's right. The best beach party ever was the one at Normandy. Beach blanket bingo is now beach blanket bombing with the latest in fashion artillery. That's right. Shelling on the beach takes on a whole new meaning. Let's get in position, Frank. Ready, aim, fire. Now let's see how we've done. Hey, wait a minute. I can hear the war. Oh, knock that off. Oh, now don't look, at look at here. Look, there's still a little red. I'm sorry, I can't give you the bear. Well, what do you think, Joel? Boy, we sure think differently, yeah. thank goodness, mm -hmm. you know. You know, you guys took something fun and made it evil, whereas I took something evil and I'm making it fun. Check it out, it's the tickle bazooka, all right? Wow. It's for those times when just a normal tickle huh. isn't enough. Huh. I based it on the premise of what the pundits, Fireside Theater once spoke, fighting's out of style, fun's where the fear is. Yeah. See, it's got a... Uh, Feather bayonet for hand-to-hand -hand tickling. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Oh, <laughs> okay. And then if you really want to have some big blast of ballistic hilarity, there's the mirth mortar. Let me show you. Uh oh. Uh, Where's okay. yourself? Head for cover. Smile. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> that is so neat. We could base a whole party around that. We could all get in our fuzzy feety pajamas and jump up and down on the bed. <laughs> Look, the only party we're going to is the one where we dance on your grave. Oh, will I be invited? You'll be the guest of honor. <laughs> now, tell them about the movie. I gotta get out of this thing. I'm chafing like a bear. Well, Joel, this week's movie is called Catalina Caper, and it is 
delightful. It's a veritable feel-good movie, a lighthearted romp, a triumph of the human spirit. Thank you, Tommy Kirk, for making us laugh about love again. And it's got a great theme song. You're going to love it. Never, ever, ever see Oh, fun. That was yeah. fun. Huh. Great what, fun. What gives? Mm -hmm. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Interesting. What's wrong with this, this guy's feet? He has prehensile toes. What do you suppose frogmen's legs taste like? Uh, <laughs> like San Diego chicken legs, <laughs> probably. <laughs> So, uh, what's in the can? I think it's a dehydrated water. Oh. Oh, a scuba film. Hmm, Jacques Cousteau meets the Pink Panther. By this time, my... Hey, come on. Huh? No, okay. okay. So what's a Catalina caper? Uh, it's one of those little balls you find when you're eating peel and eat shrimp. Oh. Sorry, Charlie, only the best titles are picked. Starring Tommy Kirk, why must Spock die? Oh, Robert Donner. I went to his party. <laughs> Gee, I wonder what she's harping on about. <laughs> hey, who's this guy? Jim Beggs, Sue Casey, Lyle Wagner, Mike Bludgeon. Nice measurements. 36, 2, 85. <laughs> I think that fish is gonna spit up again. Who's afraid of Vanita Wolf anyway? <laughs> Charlie, they cut off my thumbs. Special guest star Peter Mamakos. Oh, Little Richard. I've heard of him. He's not as famous as Peter Mamakos. Mm -mm. Oh, he's playing a trick on that fish. Oh, yeah, feel good about kicking a fish's butt. That's real nice. Hmm. Screenplay written in crayon. What's Clydeware? Hmm. <laughs> Sal Mungio, Rebel Without a Gauze. <laughs> It's like bowling will show, doesn't it? Yeah. Here's something you really like. Shalom! <laughs> Look out! <laughs> wow, that is really good animation. Now I'll set fire to the Walt Whitman books, then I'll burn the pile of ketchup in the rise. Come on, you ho-daddies, let's burn some books. yee -hoo. Burn the witch, burn the witch. We shall cleanse the earth with fire. Of Nature's witch. Well, these clan meetings have really lightened up. Look at that. Now that's what I call art. Scantily clad women and a Huey Lewis news sound on the radio. This is the kind of padding I like to see in a film. Throw another beach boy on the fire. Whoa. And so the white Aryan youth dance around the funeral pyre. You know, this is really good sound, and it was before Dolby. Uh, Dolby Gillis? <laughs> I don't know. Meanwhile, in the dark and penetrable void, John Paul Sartre was a moving and a grooving. No exit, baby. Oh, looks like they're uh, in the night gallery. This portrait, a man who smokes more than Edward R. Murrow or Lillian Hellman. I'm William Conrad for First Alert. When you're heading down to the refrigerator and the power goes out... <laughs> hey, it's Steve Higgins. Oh, you mean the star of the Higgins Boys and Gruber yeah. is seen on the comedy channel? Yeah. Wow. This must be Tommy Kirk's Oscar. He's so good that they, they gave it to him before they started the film. He huh. beat out Troy Donahue and Frankie Avalon. Huh? 
Hey, I beat out Dom DeLuise and James Coco for this role, now beat it. He's looking for that string quartet. An original Red Skelton, that's incredibly valuable. Good night, may God bless. This painting is blue, don't work blue in such a way. I'm gonna put this in a frame that fits. Gee, it looks like a garage rag. Sim security. I'm the one who cracked that crime at one potato too. I beat out Al Molinaro and Jesse White for this role. Oh, that's a family circus. Looks, from Hank looks, Ketchum's Bill Keen collection. Looks kind of like a Reuben. What, Paul Reuben? You mean Pee Wee Herman? No. <laughs> Oh, he broke Tommy's Oscar. Oh. Well, I did the same thing to his Pulitzer. Huh? Hmm? What? Hmm? Oh, who's putting it together? Oh, relax. They'll just think it's a Rothko now, see? Yeah, this is yeah, a Mondrian, bro. Boy, that's a big whistle. You know how to whistle, don't you? You just put your lips together and cut to the bow. <laughs> Bangkok, Oriental City. Hoyana, Scott City. Life out of balance. You know, this film is a fantasy because you generally don't see cabs in Southern California like this. <laughs> America's fastidious and well-groomed youth living a clean lifestyle, pumping their clean, hard-won dollars into a clean economy that is sunny, colorful Catalina. Hmm. Are you really? Oh, look at this. White people voted the best people in the world. Young white males still on top. NEA denies Bill Keen Grant. Oh, it looks like Brutus and Popeye after Slim Fast. Yeah, Olive's standing right behind him. Hmm. Not bad. What's that supposed to mean? I'm going on board, Bob. I know. I can okay, see it sir. in your eyes. Mother! Charlie Baby's come back to the nest. Welcome home, delinquent. Oh, thanks, but we're felons now. <laughs> Hi, I'm Bob Draper. Fool must have assigned you as keeper. Don Pringle. <laughs> Heir to the potato chip rest. fortune. Never seen the big water before. I figured a summer on the island put a little juice in the old battery. <laughs> I think you'll like it if you can take him. If I did, you should have seen him coming up the coast. I don't think they sell bikinis in Arizona. <laughs> well, they sell them. But I never saw so many trying to cover so much with so little success. <laughs> Thank you, Winston Churchill. <laughs> I felt the same way myself. It only gets better. Say. Uh, talk about mm. Have you seen the new crop? And my I corn is as high as an elephant's eye. <laughs> I've seen three exactly my type. Yeah, real dog. Look, somebody stole another There's painting. Final boarding whistle. Yeah, ridiculated. I'll be around if only to keep you guys out of trouble. <laughs> I love this good-natured ribbing. <laughs> <laughs> well, what do you suppose this guy's up to? Mm -hmm. oh, oh, oh. I don't believe it. You saw Big Jake. <laughs> Here, let me help you up with that. Say, that gangplank really gave you what for, friend. <laughs> <laughs> he should okay. wear a truss. Cue the made-for-TV music. Love, exciting, and new. <laughs> Duh. Smell that air, huh? Take a look around. Mm. Air, water. Air, water. You're pretty observant there, pal. It's far more exhilarating diversion below deck. I didn't know you were holding, my compadre. Maybe you're not ready. I'm ready, I'm ready. I think the forum will be good for me. I plan the agenda. In Phoenix, you showed me all the ugly glories of Gila monsters and cactus and pants. On Catalina, believe it, man, I am team. Surfing. Girl. Big game fishing. Girl. Scuba diving. God. Girl. He sounds like Kirk Gowdy, doesn't he? Or Hugh Hefner. <laughs> I'm in your capable land. And we start the summer with a bang. Like we start right now, below deck. You mean deck. Well, deck, huh? deck. I've been driving all night. Breathe, live, if Mohammed won't come to the mountain. Hmm. <laughs> well, I think that's inappropriate social behavior. Excuse me, I gotta go invent the walk now. After this. And so I want to join the forum. Hey, hmm. nice railing. May I retie your pants? She was quiet out here. It was quiet. 
What an idiot. I've never seen the ocean before. Well, then you have missed much. Yes, it's only 75% of the Earth's surface. Yes, I have. There is a whole world in this world, Ash. And there is life. All sizes, shapes, and colors. Gibbs, huh? You sure could get hung up on it tomorrow night on the beach. Yes, I'm hung up on it right now. Help in me. I dove into the sea and began swimming underwater. And there was this small fish. She's beautiful, He wasn't Joel. afraid of me at all. Hey, was she in the movie the David and Lisa? I think she's pretty. Fishing boat ahead frightened. And I never saw my little friend again. Hmm. You know, there's a psychiatrist on board. I think How he could really be, help you. For the weekend. Perhaps longer. Why? Great. Because would you like to go swimming with me? With me and Edie Sedgwick and Rod LaRod? Oh, that would be wonderful, but I'm afraid that... Don't get Say. Hey, we're done with the forum. We're druids now. I'm the truth. I can't help whatever it is I do to them. Come on, let's go. Oh, I'd like to make their scene, but they're a little weird. And hey, fishy, 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 come here, little fishy, hey, fishy. Hey, let's dig little Richard. Really turn it on. Little Richard, I hate impressionists. Oh, you're thinking of Rich Little. Oh. Now pay attention, you guys. This scene is obviously really important to the film. This is Little Richard. Uh-oh. Uh -huh. Dig this. Prince, I hope you're watching this. Hey, we have a chair downstairs with that upholstery. Uh, it looks like a coffin lining. Hey, get the funk out of my face. Come on. Dig it. Well, there's uh, really nothing we can say about that, is there? It's not during family hour. Hey, look, it's Alan Seuss. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Let's get seasick. Hmm. I think I know a bright young singer that's popped up on goofballs right now. Is he yes, in this I scene? Do. Yes. And his head's about 10 feet tall. Hmm. Hmm. I like the pencil thin mustache. Okay. Hey, oh, it's his band. Great. Next we'll see Sly Stone with the uh, Up With People problem. Right? I turn it with the cow seals. It'll all be in casts. James yeah. Brown and the Starland Vocal Band. Maybe? Yeah, George Clinton with the Ray Conniff Singers. <laughs> like this, Mr. Richard? How's this, huh? Is there a history of epilepsy in your family, boy? <laughs> you know, he's so hopped up. Uh, he, I think he's thinking he's at the Apollo or something. I like him. Hey, it's Ron Howard's brother. Man. 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 Hey, whoa. Looks like Cousin It with a bob. A yeah. swinging bob. Mm -hmm. Little Richard, the only genuine talent in this film. You know, those dancers are standing on dumpsters. Would that make them white trash? Um, I'm glad we recycle. The Nazi party! Everybody! You know, I'm feeling like the we Nazi were at the party. dance thing and laughing, kind of. Oh. Well, you were great. Now leave. Out the back door. Well, it's just us, Timmy. When you graduate from Pat Boone University. So Falco leaves the Calypso. And another painting is stolen. Oh, is this where they filmed the boat next? That looks really familiar. My skull is an amplifier. Yeah, I did it. I did it. I'm proud, man. Hey, you got puke on my radio. Oh, you got radio on my puke. Actually, I think he's uh, working on a new script. He must be the screenwriter. Yeah. Make a... Oh, magic balcony, take me away from this kooky crowd. I'm the white guy who runs this ship. I can take out this whole crowd if I wanted to. I'm that powerful. Disperse. It's time to vacuum the pool, I think. 
Hey, you got room for one more extra? Wait for me. <laughs> oh, they've got a fat dumpy guy in this already. Oh, sorry. They're diving for chum. <laughs> got it! Got it! Hey. Got it now! Jump him up! Petticoat hey. Junction! <laughs> Yeah, what gives? He's the guy with the implant. Uh, Carol? Uh, Carol? Uh, Carol? Hey, Carol? Harvey? Carol? How's your little fish? We have a proper love. I got your stick, Mr. Luthor. Oh. oh would you give me that? Sorry. Man, I'm too tired to even do one of my famous craft balls. I'm, I'm all hurting and hot and hurt and stuff. Oh, now, guys, just sit right back and you'll hear a tale. <laughs> Crete, ancient civilization. Mykonos, modern civilization. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Mel Brooks, Anne Bancroft, and Tom DeLuise in Boat Nicks 2. Oh, shut, shut up. up. Lawrence, you're, we're really proud of you. You're a credit to your profession. Village idiot. <laughs> I do the best I can with what I've got. Which isn't a whole hell of a lot. Let's go downstairs and I'll show you. Uh, Tad is below. I'm afraid our son wouldn't approve of our... Your son? What is this? Who's afraid of Virginia Woolf? I know what you mean. It's not your son, You George. just can't trust a kid who don't follow baseball. Or trust a guy with a dumb Crayola hat. Yeah. Hey, it's filled with M&Ms. Mm. Neat. Long ones. Well, let's see here. You are a child of the universe, no less than the trees and... That's Desiderata. What do you think, Ed? It's a Howard Johnson placemat. I don't think you won the riddle contest. Well, with the equipment we had below, it shouldn't take long. Say. I should have the duplicate finished in less than 24 hours. She's something. We're a great little team. Oh, uh, shut up. Yeah, not enough for an infield, but it's the William Burroughs figurehead. Even they make me sick. Hey, why two? Hmm. One for the genuine, one for the duplicate. One for the, for the little girl who lives down the lane. Jody Foster? Yeah. Boy, now we know the everything. entire plot. Thanks a lot. Hey, have you contacted our fat Greek pigeon yet? Hmm? Friend Lakopoulos arrived He's last the Topolis. You know, I hear he's got a whole castle filled with stolen art treasures stashed away in Switzerland. Nerds Popolis. How come a millionaire like Dino Lakopoulos wants to be a crook? Because he's in Scropulous. One needs a profession to procure one's taste, Lawrence. Oh, I see. First Can I like that for you? Oh. He okays it, right? Right. Right. Mm -hmm. Then we slip in the phony scroll that you're going to paint tonight. Mm -hmm. Then Donald goes in where the others have been. Then you'll return the original to its rightful owner. Uh -huh. And then return that now shirt that to Robin like Williams. Yep. I mean, how come we can't keep it? Ooh. We certainly can't keep it. That would be dishonest. No. Well, the deal we're pulling on Lacopolis ain't exactly kosher. Oh, no, hold the mail. Uh, not quite the same. Lacopolis is a proud thief. That's the only way he'll do business. It's expected one will try to cheat it. Like Nixon. Arthur, you've outdone yourself this time. Why, oh, you're simply glowing with him. That's sweat. Ah, oh, dear, I'm really very proud of you. Thank you, dearest. I must admit, I do have a flair for this sort of thing. Alcoholism? True, true. <laughs> Betty won't fall. Oh. Well, well, we better beat it, guys. Oh, yeah. Joel, could you tell us about this thing called the 60s? 
Yeah, I'm amused and fascinated by such an environment that the beautiful, creepy girl existed in. Well, I was just a little kid when it happened, but I could tell you guys what I remember. Okay. Well, yeah, you're so much older than you're younger than that now. Yeah, whatever, uh, Crow. Anyway, Kamba, could you run that music? Yeah, cool, hey. okay. Well, it was a lot simpler time back then, you know? Like, uh, I'll give you an example. Like, it wasn't uncommon at all for your mom to come and serve you a great big char-broiled steak while she smoked and uh, drank a tab and made a, your dad another Manhattan for the road. And that was just breakfast. Oh, go on. Yeah, there were seatbelts in cars, but Sex. nobody used them. Pre-sweetened cereal, subliminal messages. Drugs. People smoked openly on The Tonight Show. Hey, uh, tell us about the Rat Pack again. Oh, okay. Well, as you know, uh, Frank Sinatra was chairman of the board, Drop and everybody box. else filed on in line, except for Jerry Lewis. He had had a falling out with Dean Martin, Turn and uh, on, they already had chosen Joey Bishop to be their comic relief already, so he was kind of out of luck. But Dean was tall and tan and Bye quick God. with a song, and he just had to say the word, and Sex. cuckoo chicks would file on up the to the hospitality name. suite and massage Peter Lawford's neck and make everybody groovy Most drinks times. while they took important phone calls from places like Palm Springs and um, the White House until Ooh, turn me it on was that time man. for Frank Sinatra, the chairman of the board, to come Ooh. out of the sauna and he'd say the words and the dollies would go take Three a nap. Hands. Little messages. Oh, uh, t tell us about the rabbits, Joel. Yeah, that's the rabbits. a good one. Okay. Meanwhile, in the Windy City, um, Hugh Hefner was cooking up his own groovy scene in the aptly yeah. named Playboy Mansion. Oh, wow. Okay, there was George Kennedy and George Hamilton and Tony Curtis and Bill Bixby were all huh? in his court. Sophisticated men who knew their racket. I think you're swinging into high. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, anyway, there was um, like Twiggy and Abby and Peter, Paul and Mary, Dion, Donovan, uh, uh, Melanie, uh, 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 Abraham, Martin, and John. So you know? they just went by their first names like that? Yeah, like you, Crow. Hey. And there were typewriters, but nobody used them. And women were called girls. Wow. And businessmen wore double breasted suits, had double chins, drank double bourbon, straight no cool. chaser. Before, during, and after Peter important Max. business meetings Peter and uh, summit talks. Everybody I'm believed what the president said. Why shouldn't they? Sitting. Sexually provocative spot? humor wasn't on TV, it was on cocktail napkins, and Toys. we liked it that way. Toys had metal edges and little uh, pieces that were breakable and would fit into your mouth. They would take Donuts. and make a playground equipment out of stainless steel, then haul it up on the asphalt Donuts. where you could get hurt. Parents were actually told to spank their kids. Well, my mom actually made me go and get the belt you know, in front of Joel. company, and that was really Joel. frustrating Joel. because Joel. once they made me Joel. take a bath Joel. in the front yard. Why can't you be like everyone else and just remember the good things about the 60s? Yeah, like Woodstock. Oh, the Woodstock, great. Okay, no, Joel, you can't go to Woodstock. You're nine years old. We're going to the opening of the new Century Store. Oh, yeah, on Echo Lane. Three days of peace, love, and pizza rolls. We're going to uh, buy you a shopping people, cart Joel's for your in birthday, a lot of pain. Joel. Oh, boy, we'll be Peter right from back. Axe moved freely among men. They were, t oh, did I mention there were drugs at that time? Yeah. And then... Yeah, and the only shoes they had were PF Flyers and Keds, and that Joel. was it. Nothing, no pumps, okay. no nothing. Okay, okay, Joel, okay, oh, yeah. you can cool it now. You okay? Yeah. Hey, look at the prow on that steamer. <laughs> Let's climb aboard. Whoa. Oh, boy, mate. Hello, Betty. Yeah, that's one of my chicks. Turn to what? The Comedy Channel. <laughs> Little promo there, gang. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hiya, show. Hello. 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 Wow. So we have breakfast at the club, dear? That would be nice. I wet myself. <laughs> Ooh. Thank goodness this briefcase is a personal flotation device. I love that trombone. Welcome to White Island, acting like we deserve this kind of lifestyle. Only the best looking girls get to be starfish. Doc, it's great to have you home. Hey, it's great to see you. What? What's your name? Hi. Want to trade hair? <laughs> sure made the scene out there. It's all your fault. You weren't supposed to be here until tomorrow. We finished our exams and split a day early. 
Hey, well, how are things in the fatherland? Well, Mom got hung up on the tennis pro at the club. This must be Don Pringle. You named it right, Miss Bunny. I understand Hi. your ruffles Welcome have ridges. <laughs> Chuck mentioned you were coming in his last letter. We'll try to make your summer as eventful as possible. Oh, wow. Well, I'm prepared to defend myself against anything you might have said about me, if I have to. He said you were a jerk. Something tells me apologies are in order, Miss Bunny. Miss oh. Bunny. Oh. Now, Mikhail, what the hell are you doing? That guy looks like uh, Ralph on Green Acres, doesn't he? Are you folks all right? Oh, yeah, sure, we're fine, fine, all except my assistant. He's a little wet. I left him on board. I'm awfully sorry. That was pretty stupid of me. Oh, think nothing of it, young lady. Those you are blonde, after I'm all. I'm Arthur Duval. This is my wife, Anne, our son, Tad. Charlie Mark. My sister, Tina, and this Tad is the Tad, 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 Tom, Paul, Bob, Carol, Tad, Alice. You can't stop that. Isn't that the Sloan's yacht you're using? Uh, yes, matter of fact, it is. Oh, the Sloans. We met the Sloans in Monte Carlo last season. Charming people. Oh, when they, they lie so gracefully. the summer here at Catalina, they insisted that we have the use of their yacht. Yeah. Is this your first trip here? Well, yes, we haven't had much opportunity to visit your little uh, treasure island. <laughs> However, we are interested in learning all there is to know about treasure, aren't we, Anne? Oh, <laughs> 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 hey, I just became a Mormon. I'm with you, Miss Bunny. Dad, Miss why don't you Bunny? come along? We're going to split with the boat for some scuba diving. Oh, oh, but of course. Oh, that's a very kind invitation. Tad's been cooped up aboard ship since we arrived. Tied to a man. Give you a chance to enjoy yourself, son. Meet some people your own age, like Miss Bunny here. Get away from your infeminate father. Man. Live a little. No, thanks. Next time around? Not nearly enough beautiful women for me. Dad, could I see you for a minute? Certainly, son. Uh, excuse me, dear. I'm going up to the hotel to give another son hat. You know, Dad, what is it, Mom's Dad? really hot. Dad, why did we come to Catalina? Came to enjoy ourselves. Why? Whenever you and Mother come to enjoy yourselves, it means you're involved in some kind of a shady deal. Well, I know you've been hanging around with that Dave Delgado guy. To the quick. I'm glad your mother isn't here to listen. When you talk like that, I know you're up to no good. And when you smell like that, what somebody must die. What kind of shady deal could we possibly be involved in on a small island like this? I don't know. Yes. But whatever it is, you and Mother are right smack in the middle of it. Ted, I give you my word. Your mother and I are here on a holiday, and for no other reason. Yeah. Now, I'm starved. Let's get something to eat. Yeah, and when you give that take to the camera, what do you expect? Oh, my dad, I love him so. Uh-oh, hold it, you guys. <laughs> this is going to be funny. Yeah. Now, just let yeah. it play out. I want to get all the like, great humor in it. Get ready to laugh. Great physical comedian of our time. Heck of a walk from the mainland. Oh. And, and then it gets funny, right? Hmm. Uh. Oh, well. Or maybe not. Is that the funny part, Phil? I guess. This is the place. OK, Miss Bunny, drop the anchor. I already did. Wow. Oh, we need a new shower curtain. What's the imagination? I don't have one. Ever do any diving, Don? Oh, yeah. yeah. Right. University. Not quite. Hey. There's a trick to it. Just remember one thing. You'll be underwater. Breathe normally, but through your mouth, not your nose. Bottoms up. He's always saying that. We don't know why. Hey, it looks like a gas. You'd better use the ladder. Oxygen. I'm on the diving team, remember? Congratulations. Now I'll use the ladder. But I said I was on the diving team. It's the Pueblo. So I just keys. Hmm, mm, very interesting. But stupid. What is it, Mr. Lacopolis? Let me have a look. Don't get excited, Foreman. Too young for you. That isn't fair. You keep your mind on the Say. kids. I'll take care of everything else. An exchange I student. I contacted Duval. Now, he Barbara, buff him. my head. Fortunately, Duval is a thief. A clever one. Ooh. Remember that. You must trust no one and be very careful. And remember something else, too. An object in motion tends to stay in motion unless acted upon by an unbalanced force. Now get out. Doesn't sound very Greek, does he? And a very stupid one. You, the purported art expert, I can replace. Okay, Daddy Warbucks. I promise you a long walk home. Then I'll kill you again. Should I go put the horse's head in my bed again? Hi, Kaiser Wilhelm, you kooky monarch. <laughs> Metropolis is still out there. Hmm. Yeah. Is that your hand? You know, I'd give a month's pay to know why he's got such a sudden interest in California water. Five bucks? Sure must be nice. Have all that bread. Cruise Coast. around the world on your own yacht. 
Eat all the fruit, yeah, throw away the rind. He'll die in the ocean, and when he does, those mm -hmm. vultures at work for him will pick his little world clean. Hmm. Nice analogy. I know I hired you for something, Rod McEwen. Let's break for chat. Watch for a while. I'll see you later. They are a couple of salty tars. What will I do now? Hold on your face, Matt. Hold on your what? Can you breathe all right? Good good. Now duck under and come around. Stay close to the surface. Wow, this is the weirdest Lamaze class I've ever seen. <laughs> it's all blue and you okay, sweat and stuff. You want to cough out while you're still ahead? I know, stud. <laughs> you won't stop breathing. Let's try it again. Take a couple of deep breaths through your mouth. Uh, oh, that's this thing, right? The slit in my face? Yeah. But not up this time in two minutes. Fake it without me. Ready Fake to it? give it a try? Mm -hmm. I'm with you. Hang on to my waist. Anything you say, teacher. Down, hey, hey. You've got the wrong sport. When does it become the right sport? When ESPN merges with the Playboy that, channel. Now get underwater! Remember, breathe through your mouth. Not through your hands. By this time, my lo <coughs> I'm sorry. So I, that was me. I'm sorry. Need some Jacques Cousteau jokes instead, will you? What happens when I turn off the air? Sorry, I hear Ivan Tor is casting a new adventure show in the Keys with a dolphin. What happens if I see a Leviathan? You won't pay the full price. Get the trip. Hmm. Time to impress some people. Then I'll go out and start a line of clothes called Polo. Oh, I look like Phil Harris, don't I? Know I? This Mormon guy. He'll he cast us in Excalibur. Gotta know about killing and things like that. Oh, oh, he's got it up here. Do you know that he knows? The batting average of every white stocking player of the 1876 season? Oh, shut, shut up. up. Somebody out to check the painting, but in broad daylight, and, and so soon. Oh, boy. I should have stayed in real estate. Yeah. Oh, that's my watch. It does that every quarter hour. Cast off. Hmm? Cast off. Uh, yeah, oh, it hurts when I think. Cast Let's off see. the line, idiot. Oh, the line, yeah, right. Uh, the rabbit goes around the hole, and then it comes out the other, but it... Oh. Uh, Meanwhile, on Bruce Wayne's stately yatched yacht, pardon me. Hey, there's a boat out there. You think that's him? No, that's us, you fool. It's an exterior we'll shot. Mm. Well, if you ask me, we're sticking our necks way out playing ball in his park. You don't even have a How neck. How come we gotta show the real Protolacopolis man? One thing you must learn, Lawrence, is that you show the genuine item to bait the hook. Proving to the buyer that you have it is one of the distasteful but necessary things about this business. Tell me when you're done. Maybe he won't show up anyway. Borland specified the cove away from the harbor for the rendezvous. I doubt that he'll miss it. Now get away from me, little man. Patience, Lawrence. One other thing that you must learn. Now draw anchor. Oh, draw there's anchor. that watch of mine again. Where? When you get out of here. Enjoy the day you die. Okay, all right. <laughs> oh, uh, remember great. that last time? We were uh -huh. a little disappointed. Yeah. I think now we're going to see a scene that's ripe with comic possibilities, all right? Absolutely. The real mechanics of comedy. Mm -hmm. Tragedy tomorrow, comedy, comedy tonight. tonight. Yeah. A Jacques Tetti of the boating world. Yep. I'm ready. Sir Hulot in Catalina. You know it's going to be funny. He's wearing corduroy. That's right. Going to get doused. This is, this is uh, the funny oh. right here. Oh, well, he's going to catch his foot in the rope, right? Oh, no. Number 27, the old boat and the anchor trick. Uh, oh. But where's the funny? Oh. Oh. Hey. <laughs> Didn't come out of his tuck in time. Russian judge gives him a three. Oh, that wasn't really funny at all. That was kind of stupid, actually. Well, I, I'm the bad guy. Remember the me? <laughs> hmm? Andy Graham. Uh, I Sarah. am death. Have you ever read our watchtower? On time, eh, gentlemen? <laughs> Where's the scroll? Did What's you scroll? bring the money? Mr. Lacopolis is not a stupid man. Sure, he drools and sings camp songs. But... A fair exchange. Gee, it's hard to take him seriously in that suit. Yeah. Uh, you're soaking in it. <laughs> so, you uh, swim around here much? Were you a little hard on the fat guy? Yeah. Mm. Hmm, uh, don't you have a line? Oh, ah, uh, here he is. 
Look, the water fuzz. Hmm? Water fuzz? Yet some call them water pig. Oh, no, you don't do that. Oh, yes, I do. Oh, oh. no. Uh -oh. Oh. Uh oh. There it goes. She goes. <laughs> Please, love me. Oh. Huh? What? Spinner, pedal foot, quick, clutch is in trouble. How did you like it down there? Mm. Once I get the hang of it, I may give up the desert and rattlesnakes for life. Yeah. <laughs> Water fuzz, they're wet, they care. Tonight's episode, Death Ahoy. Yo ho ho and a bottle of death. Tinker Taylor, soldier, dead man. Michael Roll, your murder ashore. Hallelujah. <laughs> no, Timmy, no, no, darn fool, kid. Skippy's in trouble. Oh, uh, you just ate. Be careful down be there. Under there. Well, they're Good gone. Oh. Let's form a girl group. Maybe. Oh, looks like somebody swabbed the deck with somebody's butt. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Long about that time, the old Duke boys got a little trouble coming their way. The Hi. form of Mr. Skin Man. Huh? It is cold now. Oh, I just... Hi. Greetings. I come from the... Hello? Come on, come on, get out here, baby. Look at the colors, the colors. Look at the colors. Let's get back to Rye Lowe's Five. This must be a wet side story. <laughs> Join me in my dance on the dirt. <laughs> Yes, it's synchronized swimming on ESPN. The Wet Network. I'm coming, baby boy! Here he comes! I'm swimming my little legs off! I'm going to give you such a water wedge, you're not going to ever forget it. An awkward snuggie. <laughs> I can't believe he did that. I just came over to say hello. What would make a guy do with that? Here, breathe from me. Take life from me. Please. Oh, look, they're standing four abreast. Oh, right? huh? please. I'm sorry. Oh, uh, we'll just stand here, because they're men and we're not. We don't want to... Take him to the other boat! It's closer! If it's so close, why can't we see it in this shot? Uh, we don't want to be involved. Gee, what a wimp. Can't even take a seasoned diver with a knife. Boy. <laughs> I'm afraid you boys will find only evil here. I had him, Jolly. I'm telling you, I could have killed him. Well, when he took my so thumb, moved, Jolly. Uh, it's hard to judge. What happened? Well, I'm not well sure. I started in theater, yeah. moved on to Summerstock, and now I'm in this film. Why? He gun on me, and he took my wallet, and I tried to stop him, and we scuffled, and he went overboard. Hmm. He didn't have any wallet when I saw him. It was eel skin. Happy now, well, prune boy. It doesn't matter. You see, there was nothing of importance in the wallet. You see, because I'm lying my socks off. No, never. Where did he come from? Probably swam uh, out from shore, I Ah, oh, sure, yeah, that's it, that's right. Yeah, sure. Hmm, I'm kind of skeptical. Hey. Seems like an awful long ways to swim just for a few dollars. Yeah. The last time I saw him, he was heading out to sea. How would you know? You were well, drowning. it doesn't really matter. It's all over now, and I'm very grateful this young man didn't get hurt. Come on, Tiger, we'd better... Don't call me that here, Bunny, please. Uh, tanks. Jeez. I tried to. You shouldn't have brought the real one out here. He knows. He just struck out. Larry, will you please settle down? Get married, have some kids, and take that ridiculous hat off. We're concerned with the problem at hand. We've got to get that case back before Lacopolis sends his divers back for us. Now, I know the scroll case is watertight, mm -hmm. but if we lose it, we really strike out. <laughs> Think that's funny, huh? Shoot yourself in the leg. I'll be right back. All done throwing up, Spunky? Oh, I didn't know you cared. I don't. 
yacht We're gonna get a bigger boat, right? Yacht party date on such short notice. Yacht party? You really know her. Haven't you ever heard of one? Is it anything like a rattlesnake hunt? What the heck does that mean? I thought you were getting an education yeah, we gotta split. in Arizona. Yeah, well, kids just beat me up a lot when I was a kid. Really? Yeah. No, the movie. Oh. You do have a lot to learn. They swing. Really swing. <laughs> creepy girl. Oh, creepy girl, little creepy girl. <laughs> Jeez, what's wrong, Tom? Sir, well, you look as upset and downtrodden as a little robot with inarticulate limbs can look. Oh, it's creepy girl, Joel. I just met a girl named creepy girl, and suddenly I find... I <laughs> smell a song coming on. <laughs> oh, creepy girl. Lyle Wagner's a total jerk. Second only to Tommy Kirk. Could you find it in your heart to love a bot like me? That fishy story you tell always makes me sleepy. But that's just what I get for dating a girl that's creepy, my creepy girl. Oh, C is for that feeling of uncertainty for not quite knowing what ethnic group you're from. R is for the gifts you give me every time you smile. The first E is for, uh, well, I don't really know, but the second E is really a grammatical thing, because otherwise it would be creppy girl, and where would that leave us? The P is definitely not for platonic, and why? Because I love you, my creepy girl. Oh, what are you, creepy girl? Are you French, Italian, or one of those swarthy gypsy types? <laughs> well, your accent suggests a romance language, but I can't be sure. Oh, we can definitely rule out a Germanic language, but it's okay. I'm a bot without a country. All I know is that I love you. I want to shout it from the mountaintops. Uh, but I'd have to get back down to Earth and actually climb a mountain. Or they could just drop me off on a mountain. I don't care. That would be okay, because I just need you, my... Creepy girl, who won't you be my I'm? I'll give you scrolls and fish and tinker toys and wine. I'll ditch these guys if you'll be my creepy girl. Be mine before movie sign. Got a Rorschach swimsuit. What do you see mm. in it, Crow? I see the creepy girl. Oh. I see cookie pants. <laughs> I see trouble. Come on and do the dork. Hey, nice little boat they landed there. They killed it and roasted it later. Everybody get down. Oh, 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 hot, pure, oh, hot, oh, spill, nails, hot oh, wood, oh, nail, oh, 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 This is the movie that, one of the movies that shaped middle America's sexuality. It's deformed. Mm. Deformed, yeah. I could say something else, but I won't. It's cold out there. This is the place. Hell. They call it the Mirage. They call it drug-inducing hysteria. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Nice. Yeah, that guy must have something. Yeah, he doesn't yeah. shop at members Our only date. or wards. Well, when in Rome. Yeah. Or Athens. What does that mean? I don't know. Hi, Charlie. It's been a long, cold winter, Charlie. What does that mean? Uh, yeah. Get over there. I need some more chicks. What did you say your name was? Yeah, I'm casting Caligula this summer, so <laughs> come on this down. This film was funded by the Utah Film Board. <laughs> Hey, she's got a shaggy diaper that leaks. <laughs> Get it away from me. Hey, it's Ed Bagley Jr. Hey, Kiba. Hey, hey she lost the bone in her neck. Look at that <laughs> flopping around like that. <laughs> Come on. Keep them coming. Monkey love pile on me. <sighs> that must be what they mean by five easy pieces. <laughs> oh, please. 
It looks like the cast of Zoom. Come on and zoom, 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 zoom. zoom. Come on and zoom. zoom hey. Zoom, 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 zoom. Nice tablecloth there, huh? Yeah. Very practical. My posse. Oh boy. Uh, Joel, was this before yeah. cocoa butter? Yeah, I think so. Shirts by the Renaissance Festival and King John, who invites you to come down and see Robin Hood and Little John, two Never Was actors performing bad skits. And bad music. These guys are horrible. I'm going to quit this band and start a career in music. There's a couple of cheese eaters there. Yeah. Oh, please. Bee Gees go bad. Oh, er. Worse. And I haven't learned the words to say. Hey, look, I'm 60. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still rocking. Watch yeah. me. Tune in, turn on, throw up. Ugh. Now I know why drugs were so big in the 60s. <laughs> you need them. I won't pretend, pretend to see. To see. To see. To see. While the girls prance around in their BBDs. <laughs> what do you think? Um, yeah. Pretty bad. You know, lyrics by Aldous Huxley. Yep. <laughs> and most of these lyrics are in English. I think they sent the wrong people to Nam, Joe. Yeah. You know, could somebody do us a favor and push that guy's amp in the water, maybe? We can't see. Can't see. There's a concept, it's called harmony. Then the oh, look at those stupid legs. They're stupid looking. They're not real looking at all. Look like puppets. Huh? <coughs> Big Heil. Hey, anybody who wants, let's split to the beach for volleyball. Oh, no, you go ahead. That's okay. Hey, looking up. Look, we're picking up the sports channel. <laughs> Darn, and I forgot my shins. Well, the other kids hate me. Yeah. One out of twelve. See the man whose shins were stolen. Should have been on board the scuba party. You missed all the action. I heard what happened. I wanted to say thanks for helping Dad. I had to see the man. See the man, corner Wilmot and, and Carly. Away. That doesn't matter. I appreciate what you did. Yeah. I'll let you use my shins. Thanks. Deal. Okay. Hey, wh what? What'd I do? Oh, Joel, it's her. Who's that? It's a creepy girl, Joel. Oh. <laughs> Finally, a sultry woman with a nice body. It's about time. Yeah. What's women in threads like that? Watch who you're talking about, girl. It's my girl. Come on, follow the leader. No. no. He's none too happy. Mm -hmm. Dibs. I call Dibs. She's mine. Back off, you clowns. Get her out of here. I'll take you all out. Let's try walking like her. <laughs> hey. mm. oh, slow burn coming up. Mm. Are you coming, Don, or not? <laughs> Well, you'll do nicely. Let's go have little Marty Milner's. Remember what I said about the last man on Earth? Well, it's time. Are you unattached like I am? You mean from reality? Yes, why? You don't catch on very fast, do you? What do you mean? I'm afraid I'm not used to the speed. Oh. Hmm. Don't tell me you're a drag, too. No, There's just a, a drag queen. Out. Mardi Gras here. Think you can handle the beach party? I think it's worth a try. OK, let's go. Uh, what about him? Not engaged. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Loose morals, huh? I get it. 
Meanwhile, on ESPN. Everybody ditch the little guy. Uh, so the game's over, huh? Hey, 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 come back here. Hey, what's the matter with me, huh? Bad breath or something? Uh, I guess I'm kind of messed up after all. Nobody likes me. Where she is? <gasps> what do you see, Tom? Is she okay? I'm going out to get her, Joel. Quick, how do I get her? I, I gotta... Oh, no! Well, both, actually. Oh, no. I'm... Oh, I can't help her, Joel. Gee, what a nice guy. Uh, excuse me, can I have my... Uh, uh, where are you going? I'm sorry, uh, I'm going to need that back. Uh, excuse me, I don't go too far with that. It's my windbreaker. I paid five bucks for that at Ward's. Please. Oh, thank you, God. Hmm, he's kind of caught between a rock and a hard place. <laughs> Done? Sorry, I didn't mean to embarrass you. <laughs> Isn't this movie enough? Well, this is no time to be delicate. It's a good thing you stayed behind. I was ready to sacrifice my modesty. <laughs> oh, we'll get to that, my love. I found out my suit is not for swimming. <laughs> oh, Joel, I have a question. What yeah. happened to the Where treasure hunt part of the film? Well, the movie's only half over. Maybe we'll learn something about Don't it. Don't look for your little oh, okay. fish. Oh, you remember? Oh, yeah, your deep seated psychosis, of course. He talks on the boat, that is, I should say I talk. But we never really met. I'm Katrina Carelli. And I'm Cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. Nice to meet you, Don. So you're here on an outpatient basis. I like that. Huh? Your friends certainly know how to enjoy themselves. They're a fun group. They sure know how to get their kicks. Why aren't you with them? Well, I don't know how to get my kicks. Is that why you stay? Yeah, something like that. Like with my little fish, I was afraid I wasn't going to see you again. I'm glad I was wrong. Join us. Join the party and be the rules of Earth. How about it? Well, I'm kind of cooped out I'm about that little fish and everything. It's all hot and it hurts and stuff. His name is Angelo. Yeah, he's a Teenage Mutant Ninja he has Turtle. He something very important to do. And he's probably looking for me right now. He told me to wait down at the oh, pier. Where? Where? Oh, he said something about take a long, short walk on a long pier? Or? Something like that. Mm. It's a dysfunctional relationship. I'd like to thank you. I'd like to the thank jacket. the producers and the directors, too. Has he been gone long? No, not very. Hmm. Don, <gasps> would you like to help me look for him? Sure. I'll help you. Go? I'll help you. Down this way. So, did you call Harry Callahan yet? I'll need three more expert divers by this time tomorrow. And two implants. To what are we diving for? That's none of your business. Well, Mr. how do we know when we found it? You to dive, not to ask questions. You'd better get out of here. Uh, like this? Like that. Uh, now I'm going to go polish my suit. <laughs> there she is again. You sure he came down here? Yes. He said he had to meet the man on the beach. Oh, that means he has to go to the bathroom. It's a guy thing. Yeah. Well, I think I better go back and wait for him. Angela has such a bad temper. Hmm. Hmm. Angelo Dunn. Trina. You dig this, Angelo? We're going to be married. Not what I asked you. Dig him. I'm a thousand feet tall. Katrina! Why didn't you wait like I told you to? Oh, you were gone so long. You still should have waited. She was worried. And you keep out of this. Hey, call him, man. Oh, you look at trouble. Don, please. Let me take care of this. All right, but if you run any static, just yell. Just yell. Call for the turtle boy. Yeah. You were very rude, Angelo. You had no right to be on the beach with a stranger. <laughs> Angelo! Something is very wrong. Who is this man of patience for doing nothing and those men you always with? Oh, he's from paid programming. This carabinet thing isn't going to last That's forever, none of your you know. concern. I never should have brought you here in the first place. I should have brought Perhaps Vicki Lawrence. Perhaps you're right, Angela. Hmm? Yeah. What is 
Yeah. All right, I'm all for it. Hey, but we ran. Hey. It's whack. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Okay, now, Joel, how do we comment on this without getting into big trouble? Uh, you can use metaphor, maybe. That's very good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I read my mind. Choo choo choo. How'd you saw your sister? Oh. Oh, I'm tired. Wait, get a pen down his throat. Break him. He's tired from all that make out. Well, I don't even have an agent. I just saw the ad in the trade dailies, and here I am. Hey, clam bake. <laughs> Fade out, man. Fade out. Who's minding the store? Jerry Who's Lewis. The Harbor Patrol has an afternoon off. Where'd you split to? Felt like cutting out for a while. Hmm. You tried that one on my sister. What are we talking about? She's hung up with another yeah. guy. Hi, Bob. Hi, net girl. You like this suit? Mm, yet. Wild. <laughs> Don't you dare speak to me. Okay. Wow. <sighs> it's her again. It's creepy girl. Oh, oh forget it. Oh, Hi, lower life form. Hello, Don. I've decided to accept your invitation. We will be heading. If it's still open. Is Sam, you've got to be the mother of all pigeons. Yeah, tell him to stop oh, messing up our statues. Don't mind him. He's got a language all his own. Yeah, he took Aren't a shell in Aren't you going to introduce me to your playmate, Don? Hmm. Katrina, this is everybody. Miss January, everybody. this is everybody. This is this. this is Katrina. That was real dandy sport. Hmm? I'm Charlie Mark. I collect yeah, custom showgirls. But you can forget about him. He's ready for a wheelchair. Hey, come on, I'm 17. Well, Cut out the good nature ribbon. Her if nobody will introduce us. Meet the daughter of Satan. I gotta change my drift now. <laughs> Did I um, say something wrong? Where's Angelo? I don't know. I don't really care. Hmm. Because of me? That and the man named La Cupola. What about Locopolis? He'll thrash well, us from top to bottom. Us. Doing know. what? Diving, I think. That's about the only thing Andrew's ever done. Why? Could that be the diver you tangled with? I dare not tell them uh, that they speak in my family. Guy. Who's Lucopolis? I'll close up his esophagus. Then you know of his reputation. Afraid we do. I wonder why Lucopolis needs a diver. I saw it on Ted Coppolis. <laughs> <laughs> a baby's cry for help. 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 Hang on, I I'm coming. Wait, I'll get my jack. No, I don't. Oh. Stay here and protect the harem. Oh, he's so <laughs> funny in the act of tragedy. You know, it's something horrible. Oh, there he goes. Oh, wait, he's got salvage rights. <laughs> How is that? You ever tried? Keep the butt above water. That's good. Nice. Better than the tarpon I caught in Greenland. This is a keeper. I'm going to get out my fillet knife. <laughs> a surfing tarpon. You betcha. Mm, uh, oh, uh, um, oh, save. Why, the stinky guy? <laughs> she almost dies. <laughs> oh, she's got water in her lungs. Brain damage. <laughs> For you, Mo and Larry. Then if she was drowning, they would have all gone in. You might. This looks like a strange version of Lissa Strata. <clears throat> <laughs> Chicks are up in arms. They've left their fields and barns. They're marching on the farms because the kids won't drink enough milk. I would. You're a jet. You're a jet all the way. Hey, there ain't nothing like a day. You got some men in the sand. Nothing looks like a day. Nothing good. Well, this must be on the way to the Greenwich Village Halloween party. I'm thinking. I hope I get it. 
I really hope I get it. For some unexplicable reason, a deep-seated call from nature causes these lemmings to follow each other off the edge of the high cliff. Man, I got a pole with a capital O. Woo-hoo! Is he a time traveler? And now Red in the silent spot. Red's a fisherman and... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Mm. Too small, I have to throw it back. <laughs> she hit Big Jake. I feel a number coming on. Hey, we better do something, but quick. Yeah, let's do something. Hey, it's Gloria Esteban and the Catalina D06 sound machine. Hey, gang. Maybe if you do this, it'll be okay. Ready? Five, yeah. six, seven, eight. He's the pig. He's the only professional dancer they've hired, so they gotta use him. Cassie! Is that Danny Terrio? Yeah, he's the guy who taught John to a folk in band. Girls just can't resist the frolicking vibes of a hot guy. Neither can I. Body on him. <laughs> the girls begin to become aroused by the provocative gyrations of the shamed males of the village. That's a. Uh, you know, I still am having a hard time figuring out what this has to do with any scroll. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Hey, gang, let's gather around for the next scene. Hey, it's the same shot as before. I love that. Nobody <laughs> <laughs> gets it on this one. Wow, they're dancing for apartheid. That's yeah, to raise money for the National Front. It's the Keep Mandela in Prison dance. All right. They want to play Sun City, I guess. P.W. Bota, back in office. Ah, the clean smell of kids who know they rule the world. Grab that place, will you? Oh. Too bad. Next time. I'm getting done. Oh, sounds like the tape's getting eaten here. Oops. Oh. Hmm. Eight uh, track. Um, you want to tie that up over there, Servo? Uh, I'm trying to bite it. There. My arms don't work. Darn. And her name is Sybil. All her friends. Hey, this is great. You know, now that she's so famous, it's fun to see these old clips. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> really she humble origin, she went on to obscurity. Yeah, yeah it is a way to see Boogie. <laughs> hey, they grew up to be Jim and Tammy Baker. Let's not have talent, let's do away with fun. Let's all be white in the right. Snowy white. Hey, I checked out the book of love, love one time, and it was really hard to find in the library because there's not a lot of copies of it. There's just notes in the margins and the pages. Huh? Let's watch a movie, okay? And we're all white. And we swing to the right. Hey! Oh, wow. Carmine Raguso again. Hey. Uh-oh. Hiya, show. Hey, you do the jerk. The idiot. The moron. The potato up the pump dance. The dick queen. Do the white male reality. The Donald Hollinger. Yeah. Do the back row. Yee-hoo. It's just one big, sunny, fun-filled baton death march. Don't rewrite anything. We never change. Why should we? We're on top of the world. White 
It's good, isn't it? Tell me it's good. Come on. It's insane. Why did the Titanic have to sink and this didn't? I don't really you know what the difference is between the Titanic and this? What? Titanic had talent. Oh. <laughs> Thank you! Thank you! You've been a great crowd, Catalina! Tip your waitresses! Come on, everybody! Oh, oh boy. <laughs> oh, the old suitcase gag. The this is a classic. Suitcase and, uh, huh? Oh, see? No. no. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> and then, no! Oh, yes! That's so funny. This guy makes the film for me. Yeah. He makes a film for me, too, but it's... Not this one, huh? No. <laughs> okay, let's can it. Flat's back now. A pasty film on the... <coughs> hmm. The youth of today spent like so many shell casings on the battlefield of love. Now remember, I'll do all the talking. And right. you do the interpretive dance. Good man. Well, good morning, everyone. It was. I guess... <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Mr. Duval. Oh, what a lovely day for basking in the sun. What are you doing here, Dad? I just thought I'd take my morning constitution. Oh, here on the beach? At two in the afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> Can't fool you, can I, son? <laughs> no, but I've got a feeling you're going to try. Oh. Well, the truth of the matter is I'm here for a reason. Yeah. You see, I'd like to do something to put a little zing in the weekend for you kids. Might give okay. you some pennies, yellow jackets, or goofballs. <laughs> what do you have in mind, Dad? How about a scuba diving party? Scuba parties are nothing new. Oh, oh not the one I have. There's a nitrous mind. oxide in the I tanks. want you and your friends aboard my yacht by 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. How does that sound? Wild. Yeah. And you'll be diving for lost treasure. Yeah. Items worth five dollars and up. Good and job. here is the grand prize. It's a stick of dynamite. What is it? You get to throw it at. Oh, it's an old map case. Now, for every one of I these, thought I'd throw it over the side. Donate a, few a penny other to items. Jerry's care. And the diver who brings this up wins the grand prize and one hundred dollars. Bucks. Wow, but I could do with $100. Yeah, Check out her $100. Don't forget, on board by 10 o'clock. Don't forget your plot device. Dad, I've got that funny feeling again. Take an aspirin, son. Take a whole pot. Okay, I'm with you so far, but I'll be watching you, Dad. Hmm. Good boy. He's not even my son, you know. He's Marty Milner's kid. <laughs> well, the rest is up to them now. They don't come up with that scroll. You can bet what topless divers will. Oh, fly, you bring the other things to drop overboard? There's no way that guy can make some. You can talk now, stupid. Oh, oh well, never mind. Let's get I don't back see to the it, He's a comic genius. I don't see it. They are lost in Thousands Harbor, the Exxon Valdez. They should be coming up soon. What, our lunch? for over an hour, and there's no case. Patience, Lawrence. Patience. Lawrence. Hey, everybody, I found a new script, and this one's funny. Well, there's, there's bobby pins down there and band-aids, and there's a lot of hair on the drain. Mm. What do they got? That we ain't got. Courage. <laughs> Next, divers. That's the third time they talk with this thing. And our time's Same running time out. Time flies. <laughs> Charlie Sheen in Navy Seals, a Calling Columbus production. Hey, it's us again. Arthur, I have a splendid idea. Why don't they all go down together for one final effort? Without tanks. Sound idea. Is that agreeable with everyone? Yes. Yeah. 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 Very agreeable. Yeah. Thanks for asking. Mm -hmm. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. We're here to spoil everything. Over there. Hmm? They must be after the scroll. You see any other divers? Oh, no, only you. We can't afford to guess. Let's find out. What, down here? Oh, okay. This should be great. Oh, this is bad. Oh. Huh? What? Look, it's Dino, Desi, and Billy. Hey, Sinatra got him a gig. At the bottom of the harbor. He must be tripping. Huh? So entertain all those other guys at the bottom of the harbor. Yeah. What 
couple should have made us move by now. Yeah, well, I guess they figured we were just... Oh, they got sandwiches. Oh, wait, they got that pistol from the man from Glad. <laughs> I really know how to handle guys like that. Oh. You got me. Where is it? You're a very sneaky man. Oh, I'm with you. I don't have time to fool around. Where's the scroll? Should we give him three guesses? I don't see why we should. Oh, don't make him oh, mad. Don't make him mad. I can't watch, watch this. Oh, go. they look tough. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, I think it's a sarcasm sequencer. So I'm going to have to field strip you a little, buddy. Come hey, here. Ow, hey, that hurt. Give me that hey, back. Hey, neat. Hey, I'd, I'd oh, like a wing, please. The overlords are calling. Look sharp, you guys. Oh, hi, Joel. Uh, just thought you'd like to see what we got going on down here. I think you know everybody. This is Jerry, and that's Sylvia, and you know Joel and the bot, so let's get started. And Oh, Jerry, you haven't even touched your sandwich. It's good stuff. And Sylvia, coffee? Just all you want, free refills. <laughs> free real anyway, oh, we're going to have a lot of fun. Uh, so let's get started. We've got fun, easy to plan stuff here. Now, now, Sylvia, back me up on You know what I'm talking about, this one. Are you with me on this? These guns that are stored underwater, this method with the baggie and the, it makes no sense. It's totally impractical. It's, it's just outmoded stuff. We have nothing to do, but this product that I'm giving you the opportunity to get in on here. It's a triple ply polycarbonate reinforced substrate. As a matter of fact, it's the uh, type of material used by the astronauts on It's About Time. It's well, very Fred, uh, Fred, how's our new oh, venture Fred, going? Fred. Oh, whatever. Oh, well, it's... Uh, Don't mind me, I'm just going to sit in and observe. Okay. Go on with your presentation. Oh, okay, good. Uh, she gets some of that. I think we got some Wisconsin. Yeah cheese lock there uh, it's not the same thing with him okay uh we got uh oh this is uh for for storing uh, hand grenades uh, this is perfect it fits on and we have the gel in it that stores it three and look it fits perfectly uh it's uh, okay and we have the uh this salad it's Fruit salad stays perfectly well. Never would. <laughs> oh well. Here, let me just, just stick, put that there. And this is even better. Here, this will stay right on there. There's no. <laughs> here, stick that up there with the thing, and we'll put the. Oh, maybe I should do a joke. You ever notice how the mole men with the thing and. The, <laughs> with the, put the, Frank, huh? Frank, Frank, huh? <laughs> why don't you uh, just pack it all in here? It's, uh, it's okay. Why don't we just start cleaning up? I, uh, uh, I uh, <laughs> give you points for your your little party here, but uh, you're gonna hurt me, aren't you? No, Frank. I give you a. You're gonna be mean to me. No, I'm not. Why do you pull away? You're gonna be mean. You're gonna hurt me, and it's gonna be humiliating. It's gonna hurt and stuff. Look, look, Frank. You, you've got a lot to learn about being a mad scientist, and, and you know, I I think I'll buy one of your melon ballers. I've well, actually, there's some melon right up there. That'll be perfect. Frank! <laughs> Frank's going to be having a little pain. We'll be right back. This will launch my empire. I know. King Dex, man. Oh, tell your friends, dude. Oh, black water, keep on rolling. Any resemblance to a real action sequence is purely coincidental. Once you get caught between the moon and New uh, York City. Did they get the case? Oh, yes. I saw them take it away from They Charlie. took my thumb. They, oh, no, wait. They're still here. What was the other day? What's in that case? Whatever it was, it sure must have been worth a lot of bread. I knew you were up oh. to something. I want to know. What's it all about? Alfie. Fighting? I'd like an explanation, too, Mr. Duval. 
I mean, this is the second time in the last few days that I almost got myself killed. Yeah, lots of other Maybe stuff, too. Maybe if you're taking us back to Avalon, son, I'll explain a little later. Will you put your hands down, Lawrence? No, I don't want to play well, Patty Cake. we really shouldn't feel too badly. The fates were against us. And it cost us half a million bucks. Oh. Boy, the ball games I could have seen with that dough. I hope they you don't know, trace I don't think I want to live in a world us. filled with adults oh, not anymore. Not a chance! Nothing's I right. You're hurting. Real. Yeah, so, that's what I'm afraid of. Hmm. Hmm. There's always the chance of the police tracing the stolen scroll back to my folks. Are you sure this is a real scroll? Hey, who does to say what's real and what's not real, apart. man? And besides, we heard Dad talking about it. We can thank the screenwriter for that. More than a few hours. <laughs> the scroll we thought we were diving for was a phony. I just got a flash. A hot flash. When those guys find out they've got the wrong merchandise, man, they're going to be out for blood. Man, everything's coming down on Let's me today. Let's unload this hot potato on the fuzz. Cool it. Get the fuzz into this, and his folks end up in jail. Can't use this lingo Bob's anymore. Bob's already suspicious, man. especially in Acropolis. He's Your totally psychotic. Like so bad. Be my guest. I haven't got the blood to spare for those vultures. Got the hair for it. That's no good. The minute Dad gets it back, the temptation will be too much for him. And the four taps and the million spinners. dollars is too much for him to turn down. For my bread, you should have left it where you threw it instead of going back to die for it Please. later. I implore you, yeah. shut up. I have no right to say this. God, your hair but smells But I think I know good. a way to... Well, to scare the larceny out of your folks once and for all. Scare the what? And get Angelo and Foreman arrested. I'm ready to try anything as long as it doesn't involve mother and dad with the police. Or farm but animals. We know they want the real scroll. What we've got to do is make sure that they know that we've got it. I'm not about to have them take out their frustrations on me. Shut, Shut up. up. How about Charlie? And lose my image? What image? What's the play? Oh, it's a 12th yeah. night. We try and smoke out Angelo and Foreman. Oh, man? Bound to be around someplace. Let's find Tina and some of the kids. These kids today with their loud music and hula hoops. Hey, Thanks, buddy, I don't know. For those of you following along in the Sidfield screenplay workbook, that last scene was the plot point setting up the third act. Now this. Mayberry, after hours. No shirt, no shoes, no script. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, hello, mother, hello, father. Here I am at uh, Catalina. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Zach Norman is Sammy and Chief Zabu. It's the big guy. I have to sit like this since the impact. I'm watching you, Cranhead. Nothing. Here come the bunnies. Maybe they did better. Hopping down the bunny trail. Hey, it's Charlie Angels. Plus a smart one. Nobody. <laughs> At least not anybody who looks like the two you fought with on the Lyra. Hmm. Keep looking. Move out, troop. Well, it's McMillan and wife and Don, wife and wife. Can I talk to you a minute? What? Talk. Just a minute. We gotta go. What's wrong? Uh, I'm About pregnant. yesterday. I'm sorry I slapped you. And I wasn't really drowning either. Oh, yeah. I'm I not forgot all about that. Really? Really? But you do pack a pretty uh, mean wallet. Don't rub it in. I was gonna say for a pretty girl. Oh, uh, but you're ugly. Listen, Charlie Moss has got a groovy sister. You know who else thinks so? The football team? Ted. Well, I apologize to him, too. Oh. Only first. Oh. It's them! <gasps> Go find Charlie, quick. Mm. Hey, Charlie. I'll take him on. I know I can. I'll do it. Yeah. I will, I will, I will. Hmm. Lucky open table. Hmm. How come he got a menu already? Oh, peach daiquiri. So that's what I drank last night. Hmm. Nice good take, dude. I'm still waiting for my spinach omelet. And no slip up this time. Hi. Uh, yes, I am. Uh, you? I've been looking for you. Creepy girl. Don't make any heroic moves, my friend. It's too late I to rewrite the, the script. Hand it over. Angela, what are you doing here? 
Work and be an evil. Friend, I don't have time for game. And I haven't got time for the pain. Angelo! Man, everybody's coming down on him. Very Thank you. Back home, team gang. Jet, you're a jet all the way. Splendid, son. It's a That's Catalina Army now. Always be prepared. And a feminine. We'll take care of the garbage. Go get them, Don. Can you handle this one, Mr. Duvall? It's land oh, I'm sure I can. Some call them land pigs. You bunnies stay here. See what he calls your master away. Hmm? What do you mean by that? Okay, people, everybody wear eye protection. There's a lot of loose ends flying together all at once here. Wow, this Main Street USA parade is really getting thin. <laughs> Hi, folks. That's not Mickey, that's Nicky. <laughs> hey, he's running into the Haunted Mansion. Ooh. Are you a ghost host? Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 uh, all, anyone? Oh, all, I got them all. Ouch, 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 Oh, Jerry, no. Jerry, no. You got me all wet, boy. Well, I guess he's swimming back to Greece. You're late, aren't you, buddy? Take a rest, friend. You've provided enough comic relief. Thank you, Corky the Water Clown, for making us laugh at love. Again. What do you think you're doing? I've got you this time, Duval. Will you take these silly things off my wrist? I'm the silly thing. It was a thing. long time for you to make a slip. Yeah. Now I've got you. What's this all about? Who are you? Fingers O'Toole, insurance FBI, investigator. This man is division. my prisoner. And what's the charge? Grand theft. And wearing an ascot. Look, you don't even know what you're talking about. You stole the scroll from the collection, and it's in that case you're holding. Oh, wow, he's Give me holding, the case. dude. Hey, cool, a Bon Jovi poster. Kind of like a pea shooter, isn't it? Mm, good one. It's gone. It's my career. It was in there. I know it was in there. Why me? Why me all the time? Where did it go? Uh, I don't believe it. I'm Iggy Pop. Oh, boy. Oh, the script's in Braille now. It looks about 40. Closing time, young fella. The guy who lives Thanks. here wants to go to bed. Sure is beautiful. Yes, yeah, sure is. Man, I sure love that old snot rag of a... Huh? huh? So, uh, you know, win them all. The pain, the pain. I lose the ritual, gain another. Oh, Stealing off. Win one, lose one. Famous American cliché. Shaving my head. I told you it would be a long walk. Didn't I tell you that? Enjoy. Kill him. Kill him. Hmm, musical newspaper from Japan. Oh, no. Zach Norman is Sammy and Chief Sabu. So I did Oh, yikes. Uh, uh, now let's quit, I'm hemorrhaging. Hey, Mom, Dad, you got any rhythm left? We're out. Oh, how did it get out of my case? Back into the museum. Go oh, figure. Charles will say, don't knock it, Dad. Perhaps it's best forgotten anyway. Acropolis has sailed away forever. Perhaps a little bit wiser for his experience. I doubt it. There's only one answer, Anne. Somebody up there likes her. No, dear. I think someone loves her. Well, it's not me. Well, what now? What's left for us? Not Drug one running? single prospect on the entire island. Prostitution? I've searched high and low. The pigeons have all flown Some away. Lord? 
Well, you could always go to work. Yeah. Work? Mm -hmm. As Charles might say, that's a boss idea. You know, it's time I did some retiring. <laughs> well, there's that Louie and I look-alike contest. Good dance, Goofy. No, oh, I've outgrown this prep ball stuff. It was just a phase. Now I'm a swinging cat. Yeah. Hey, it's a skinhead. Get Geraldo. <laughs> hey. Oh, look at creepy girl. Doesn't she look great in a hairdo like that? I like her in a flip. Oh, he's down to one girl, huh? He's cutting back. Oh, nobody wants to dance with a big, uh, stinky guy. The shirt's louder than the music, isn't yeah. it? Dork Shack. Geek Dork Shack, Shack baby. baby. Yeah. That's what it said. Got a movie that's as long as a whale. It's about to set sail. Woo. A plot hole that's as big as a whale. Huzzah! King John invites you to the Run Festival. Come see 300 years crammed into one place. Meet the people you snagged on in high school. Bring your own tights or wear some of our own. Uh, principals to the front, please. Extras and back. Th there yeah. you go. Thank you. Oh, yeah. It was only a movie. Oh, it wasn't movie. real? Oh, it was uh, real, too. Uh, wait, I'm, I'm having <laughs> some trouble here. It was right in the middle of that. Brother. So, a I good have... movie des deserves a good encore of the cast. I wonder if we're going to see the fish again here at the end. What fish? Oh, that's right. Fish the, from the beginning? Yeah. Or? And the scroll? Yeah. That was good. I still don't really care. Um, oh. I, we got to do something to understand this. Don't this was just ever, bizarre. Ever, ever, it's something to do with a lot of foreign films with a lot of subtitles. Where did the scroll go to, and how did it get back where it was? It's a lot easier to. This is harder than the order, so I can't figure out. <laughs> I think it's important that we experienced it together, don't you? And we shared. Yeah, we better get out of here. Let's go. AMF vomit. Carry me. Oh, that's that's no. voice. Okay, please. Let's get it. Confusing movie, wasn't it? <laughs> well, no, um, not really. I only have one question, actually. Well, what's that, crew? Yeah. What the Sam Hill was going on? Yeah. Well, which, which part of the movie did you have a hard time with? Uh, well, I was doing okay until the opening credits ended, and then I thought it was like a cartoon with really good animation. You know, I'm confused, too. The only thing that made any sense to me was that darling creepy girl. I can't seem to get her out of my mind. <laughs> Ah, uh, Tom, Tom, stop the music, Cambot, cut it out. Sorry. Uh, uh, very good, Mr. Tommy Servo tune there. Uh, I had a feeling this was going to happen with this. So on the way uh, back from the theater on the spiral on down, will you move over, you guys? Excuse me. I took the liberty of making this uh, chart of the film, OK, so we could figure it out a lot better. Yeah, great. Thank you, you spinach chins. Anyway, this is going to make us all feel better. So. Let me just start explaining it, and we can help each other. OK, act one, uh, the uh, Alan Sherman wannabe in the Crayola hat, that's this guy down here, uh, steals the scroll from Pegboard Mansion. OK, uh, Tom? Uh, oh, oh, he hands it off to the Louis Nye guy, the Billy DeWolf wannabe with the Jim Backus mouth, and the upgrade wife aboard the thinnest ship in the Navy. Oh, uh, uh, I remember now. Upgrade wife drew a fake of it, which they planned to pawn off on uh, Mr. Vanopolis. Yeah. Uh, okay, slam dance Cosmopolis. Uh, do the worm Acropolis. Would you two stopolis? Okay, now, <laughs> then. Uh, Lockjaw, uh, Jim Backus, and uh, Crayola Head here get in a big plastic hassle with Lyle Wagner, and the uh, script or the scroll ends up going south. Oh, hold, hold, hold on, Joel, you're getting way ahead of yourself. What about Tommy Kirk meeting the creepy girl on the boat and the sensitive soliloquy about the little fishy? Uh, well, well, wait a minute, wait a minute. Uh, you're both forgetting uh, to mention that all the singing and dancing with little Richard tripped up on goofballs. Okay, and what the, what the heck did that it, have to do with it. anything? The entire plot was hinged on the relationship between the creepy girl and Tommy Kirk. No, listen, the whole emotional thrust of the second act was when Lockjaw throws the hullabaloo come treasure hunt 
to get the scroll back uh, in his possession. Uh, 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 wait about, uh, well, what about the dysfunctional relationship that the kid who looked like Jim Baker, you know, come on, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. shared with Billy DeWolf and Jane Bennett? I thought that was the emotional center of the film. Is there so any crow that was the emotional Tootsie center of the film? Uh, oh, 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 Man, I'm oh, teed no off. Fair. I'm gonna go get the letters. Uh, don't, 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 the letters right here on the desk. Read that little okay. Just try to calm down. Come on now. Okay. Oh, this is this is great. I'm sorry I got kind of crazy there, but uh, so my. Okay, this is a really neat letter. Let's put it up on the screen there, Cambot. It oh. says, Dear Joel, Tom Servo, Gypsy Cambot, and of course Crow. Yeah. We think you this may be a first for your show. We met, we spent time together, and fell in love watching MST 3000, and now we're getting oh. married. Oh, oh, that's We're wonderful. hoping you can make it to the nuptial festivities, but if the si evil scientists won't let you guys out, please send a picture of Crow for us to keep hey, and cherish fabulous. as a precious reminder. Oh. Tell Crow the door is jar. Okay. Oh, and thanks. here, put this up, Cam. Here's the wedding announcement. We're going to have to block out some of this so like we names. don't get a bunch of misties there. Yeah. But, um, <laughs> but anyway, but I thought Trumps that... It's the Trumps, and it's in that, New York. Yeah. Is it an open bar? I think that was super cute, cool, and really romantic. Yeah. Yeah, isn't romance wonderful? Yeah. Hit it, Cambot! Ooh, ooh, creepy girl, oh creepy girl, my eyes pour out to you in heaves and droves of iridescent shapes and stars through the sky, but I don't care, creepy girl. I got hit in the head with a crowbar and I just don't see straight anymore. All I know is I love you. Bad movie. Uh, good fruit salad. Uh, push the button, Martha Stewart. <laughs> Thank you.